This is getting ridiculous now, and I'm getting angry. God, this is worse than even when I was living in the Culver City area in California. And I always joke about, but it's not funny. That was a long time ago, too. Um, the cops stopping me at like 8 o'clock at night, uh, pulling over and stopping me. But Hope, you know, Donald's mom thought, and I kind of share sentiments, um, that the cop was pulling me over because of, um, saw me just walking at 8 o'clock at night. Um, Tall blonde with a nice body and, you know, short shorts and long legs, you know, bare. So that's what Hope thought because there was no reason for the cop to pull me over. But this is different. This is insanity. This is people can't deal with anything strange. So I'm singing out loud or walking around in the pouring rain singing out loud. Not around here, miles from here. Okay, I want to stress that, miles from here. And it's not a cop. The cop would have never stop me in a million years. I wasn't doing anything wrong. Someone actually picked up the phone and called. It wasn't even 7 o'clock at night. I'm disgusted with this. Disgusted people. It wasn't even 7 o'clock at night. Even the cop left. I said, insert name of where I live, I said, this would only happen here. We laughed. I'm like, what time is it? He's like, it's 5 minutes to 7. I'm like, you've got to be kidding me. And then I said, you know, I'm not doing anything but walking. I'm like, I'm not falling down. I'm not doing anything. And he's like, I know. But it, he has to investigate. If they get a call, but the fact is, they shouldn't even investigate. Not, not, I, I, remember, this isn't a noise complaint. This is, and I'm not saying it couldn't be somebody who knew me from around here. Obviously, it could be anybody could be someone with a stick up his ass or her ass and doesn't want to see me enjoying myself singing in, in the rain. I mean, but how sick that the, the police have to investigate. They'd have better things to do elsewhere than to investigate. I mean, I'm not, I'm, I'm not doing anything, okay? I don't cause any kind of trouble. I don't go into stores or cause trouble. I don't cause anything trouble. All right? It's not even seven o'clock, people. You've gotta, you've gotta fucking be kidding me. I was in shock. Policeman pulled up. I'm like, what do you want? You've got. I, I think the first word out of mouth. You gotta be kidding me. Please aren't pulling me over, okay? And, you know, and I'm all bundled up and I'm wearing a hat and coat. You know what I mean? It's like, so you can't do anything strange, at least not around here. Or some asshole's going to pick up the phone and call the cops. This wouldn't happen other places, okay? There are people who are crazy and do crazy things, and as long as they're not hurting you, you don't pick up the phone and call the cops. Again, it could be someone who knows me. Someone with a stick up his ass. When I say his, it's his, 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 I remember I was an Englishman, his applies to his war. Okay. <sighs> You've got to fucking be kidding me. I can't breathe. I can't fucking breathe. Had I been drinking, yes, but again, unless I go out to a bar, to a club, to whatever, I'm never drinking to any significant degree, okay? Seriously. I spelled my name for the cop, gave him my date of birth joked with him, even though I'm pissed, I'm not pissed at him, you know, but it's just sick, it wouldn't happen anywhere else, I mean, what does the person say, there's some person walking, 
I'm walking so fast that but wherever the police were called, I'm way, by the time they get there, they're not there in two seconds, by the time they get there, I'm, I'm way up, okay? It's just ridiculous. I think it was a cop, I know, remember, cops have been here so many times. So many times. Auntie tries to make it out that it's just been, they, they probably were here so many times before I here for when I was living 3,000 miles away in California, okay? Remember, Auntie finds a way to blame me for all my mom's breakdowns, even when I'm not even here, okay? That's just, pfft. Unreal. I don't cause any kind of trouble. And even when I'm drinking, again, I'm not serenading someone's house. I'm not throwing rocks. I'm not falling down. I'm not sitting down. I'm not, you know, dressed in some ridiculous clothing, like shorts and a t-shirt or something in the middle when it's cold out and rain, you know. Sick. It's just what is going through these people's heads. It's one thing if I wake you up, even though that's ridiculous too. It's another thing, you don't know, call it cops out of concern. Concern for what? Concern for what? Like Selena said, they won't even let you, you can't even enjoy yourself in the most, you know, cheapest, really innocent of ways, just singing. I even said to the cop, I'm, I'm, I said it, I'm like, yeah, if, if anyone's, I'm, because what, what, they call the cops because I'm singing out loud, I'm practicing for karaoke, I said it to them. Was that true? No. I was enjoying my new song, um, Royal Bliss is Paranoid. So good. So, so good. But the fact is, how sick. There are so many people on, you know, on drugs or causing trouble. Or, I mean, I'm not saying around here, I'm just saying in general. And I, people are going to pick up the phone and call the cops before 7 o'clock. That was the first thing I asked the cop. Okay? I'm not doing anything. I'm not loitering. I'm not lingering. I'm not, you know, I'm walking and singing out loud in the pouring rain, without an umbrella, but I had a hat on, it doesn't matter, you know, and I have to worry about some asshole calling the cops, it's ridiculous, it's ridiculous, this isn't so they woke anyone up, this is before 7 p.m. at night, I'm like, you fucking gotta be kidding me. You know when a cop laughs, he, it's, he, you know, he knows it's a joke. He knows it's a joke. I could tell he knew it was a joke. But he still, I still had to acknowledge him. I still had to, you know. Like, fuck you, whoever you are. And then I was pissed. I'm like, someday I'm going to write a book. Write about this place. About this, this is sickening. They will pick up the phone and call the cops if, you know, it's got to be. Either someone who knows me, okay, or someone who didn't like, like Selena probably say, someone who didn't want to see you enjoying yourself. Again, enjoying yourself is a, you know, we'll put that in quotations, but it, I was in my own stupid tipsy. But again, so what? So what? It's fucking, you know, it's before seven. It's not even remotely late. I was pissed off when it happened at nine on a weekend night. That was ridiculous too. Nine o'clock on a weekend night. This is technically last night was a weekend night because no one's working on Thanksgiving. So, but it doesn't even matter. It was, they had to call like, and you're going to go investigate. I mean, I feel like I'm being persecuted. I really do. Like, what the fuck? 
why you, why'd you even respond? I guess the cop has no choice. For someone to do that to me, sick. It shouldn't even be legal to do that to someone, okay? It just isn't the size I've told you before. There have been times where I was singing out loud and completely sober. And I was barely anything at that point, you know. I had no problem. I didn't lose my composure with the cop. I had, I even said, I was like, what the heck? I'm not falling down. I'm not doing anything but singing out loud and someone's going to call the cops. I said it to him. I said, this is ridiculous. It's ridiculous. It's like... I'm sickened. I'm just sickened. I can't breathe. I can't breathe. You know? If I can't be a little intoxicated and walking around singing loud outside before 7 o'clock at night without having to worry about some asshole picking up the phone and calling cops out of concern, there was never such bullshit as the concern. That's bullshit. That's just an excuse to get the cops to bother me. It's sick. It is fucking beyond sick. And again, the cop was smiling, okay, because he knew it was a joke, but he's just doing his job, and I don't fault him, right? It's just sickening. It, it's sick. It's sick. I can't breathe. That's how I feel. I can't breathe. I can't breathe. I can't escape. I can't breathe. No wonder I like to get out of this area, okay? Because last time I'm out of the area and feel safer, and then I drank a little too much, and then I fell in the commuter rail crap, so, you know. Last night before 7, no. No, it was fine. I'm not saying I wasn't slightly inebriated, but so what? So what? I'm hardly the only person who walks around slightly or more so inebriated. I see little snip, nips or whatever on the ground wherever I go, so you know. Unreal. Unfucking It's just, it, it is getting ridiculous. If, I, if it can't even be before seven, you know. It's because I was singing out loud. But of course, it's pouring out and people should have their way. Nobody should even know I'm, you know, who knows? It doesn't matter. It's sickening, okay? It's sickening whoever did it. Whoever did it is a motherfucker, and I'll never know, and I just, you know, whoever did it is a fucking asshole. Fucking, fucking prick. Or female prick, you know, just whatever, whoever did it is an asshole. And again, they're not going to do it when it's later, and I'm not singing, see? You know, when I'm not singing, I could be walking around at 10, 30, 11. I try not to. One night I lost track of time and I was doing stuff and shopping and stuff, whatever. And I did get home late. No one called the cops on me then. Cops didn't stop me, no. As long as I'm not, as long as I'm just like this, as long as I'm stifled, it's fine. But if I'm enjoying myself and no, you got to call the fucking cops because you're an asshole, whoever you are. Whoever you are out there, you are a fucking asshole. A fucking asshole. Whoever you are, you are a fucking piece of work, let me tell you. And people do, I, I couldn't even fathom it. Couldn't even fathom picking up the phone and bothering the police and calling them because someone's walking and singing in the rain or with, not in the rain or whatever, you know, out of concern. And yeah, I fucking will put that in quotations because that's just an excuse to pick up the phone and call the cops on me when I'm not bothering you and I'm not doing any fucking thing wrong and it's not even seven o'clock at night.